Hello YouTube, it is Lee Gaming back here with another tutorial and today I'm going to show you uh, how to make and use the cloning machine in Pixelmon. So first thing you're going to want to do is make a fossil machine and if you don't know how to do that um, for, oh god, hold on. Well, for the first part of it you'll need a, a tank thing and for that you need three water buckets and six glass panes uh, three on either side next you'll need a viewing screen or whatever that display screen and you'll need four obsidian and a redstone in the middle four surrounding the redstone on the top bottom left and right next you'll need a machine top which is you have to do it in this order, so two down. Don't put any in the top, so two here, there, there, and in the middle. Next, you'll need a machine base, and that's just six um, box site, well, smash box site, whatever. And now you need two of those fossil machines to make this. So to make this one, it's called. It's a orange tank. You'll need oh hold on, this must be a piece of obsidian there. You need three obsidian across the bottom, two gold on either side, a machine, a fossil machine in the middle, and three aluminum plates up top. Same goes for the green tank, but you need emeralds instead of gold. And the wait this is just ignore that. Ignore this piece, this ain't supposed to be here. But now you'll need some more. You need three obsidian on the top, three obsidian on the bottom, and six redstone. No, three redstone in the middle. And you should have these. You should have an orange tank, a green tank, and a. Uh, cloner, cloner wire, cloner cord, and now you put them all together like this, and you'll get this. Hold on, I gotta clone, clone machine. There we go. And what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want a lot of space because it is. One, two, three, four blocks wide and two blocks tall. So you want a lot of space. And let me show you what happens if you don't have enough space. So go onto a tree. Here. Slash game mode S. You do that and it just disappears. You don't get it back. So next, uh, what you... Sorry about that. But... Next, uh, it says insert mu, so you're gonna want to mu. You have to have a mu for this, so you do that, and it'll say right here, um, insert catalyst either diamond, gold, or iron, three of them. So um, iron is about 50 50 percent of what you're gonna get, gold is about uh, 25, and diamond is. Um, almost like 75 so I'm gonna put diamond it get some diamond blocks gold and iron so um, let's start with gold so I'm gonna put three gold in here one two three and wait for it processing and now here you either get a ditto or a mute so that's what a cloning machine does. See so what we got. We got a ditto. So I'm just gonna do it. Slash game mode. See for a Slash game. Wait. I'm just gonna do this quick because I'm just gonna catch the ditto. And you ha you have to do this, and you instantly get engaged in battle. So I'm just gonna catch the ditto quick to get it over with. So you see now that gold uh, is pretty much the worst. 
You don't. If you're gonna do this, you either want iron or diamond blocks. You need three of them. Remember that. So I'm just gonna catch it. There we go. Now let's try iron. So one, two, three. Now let's see what we get this time. So it's processing. We just gotta wait. Be patient. Be patient. Wait for it, and we get a ditto. Yay. You know, I'm just gonna keep placing down more cloning machines because it's gonna get really annoying having to battle these dittos and stuff. So let's get another one down. Insert the mew. Oh. Well, I guess I need some more Mews. There we go. Let's get a few more into the Mew. Now, let's try... So, we'll try Iron again. Just to see if it works. I'm going to place another one down here, just in case. So, let's see if we can get this on a second try. Processing, processing. And... It looks like we got another ditto, so it's not that bad. It's not. It's about 50-50% to get uh, Mewtwo. Now let's try Diamond. Let's see processing. So this is about 75 to 25%, and 75 being the percent of you getting it. So let's just see processing, processing, and we got a Mewtwo. Now of course. This Mewtwo does not like being trapped inside a cloning machine, so it's gonna break it, break it to get out, and you're gonna have to battle it to catch it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So now you see we have a Mewtwo here from this type of machine. So I hope you this actually helped you guys figuring out what this cloning machine does, because I knew a lot of you probably were confused about what it does, and I hope you all enjoyed and i'll see you all later my gamers of the world goodbye